Hello YouTube and welcome back to some Bad Squad Gaming. That's right, it's your boy Drake coming at you live with some more FIFA 16 career mode. That's right, you guys, this is episode 2 and oh my god. So we have been playing through uh, the majority of the preseason uh, offline so that way um, I can just, you know, sort of get some signings in order, sort of get my team, get a feel for the game because I haven't really played any actual games on this uh, game yet, but now I have, and, um, it's pretty hard, you guys, uh, you know, I, I've won the majority of the games, uh, I only lost one game, and it was to PSG, and, uh, you know, it was in the, the cup match, uh, for the champion, and, yeah, it was, it was a tough game, I lost, uh, one to four, so that was, that was pretty difficult, um, but as you can see here, I have some important signings to show you guys. Uh, so basically what has happened is I have gone ahead and signed Kurt Zuma to our squad like I said I was going to. Um, the next step is to maybe sell Nyanga Mbiwa um, and maybe, you know, use him to get a good player. Um, and I have also signed Brant. Now the reason I have signed Brant, you guys, is because of course his high potential. Um, and of course, he can play left mid, right mid, and center attacking mid, and it has four star skills, four star weak foot at the age of 19. Not to mention his height, you guys. Look at that height. Six foot one. Oh my god. With 79 sprint speed, he's going to be an absolute god in career mode. So I've gone ahead and signed Brent uh, to my squad, and he's going to sit there in the left mid and replace uh, uh, Cornet, who's been playing left wing for the past few games. Uh, but yeah, so this is looking to be like my squad, uh, to play the rest of the matches with, which is pretty good. It's a pretty good side for a team. As you can see, Gr Grinier is just destroying it in the middle, uh, for me. Uh, and so is Fakir. Fakir, absolutely outstanding. Fakir is actually already, or, Fakir or, Gr I don't know. Lacazette, uh, is pretty good as well, but they, they've sort of grown a little bit for me. They haven't really actually, like, leveled up or anything, but they've grown, and I, I really like to see uh, their potential grow a little bit higher uh, within the next few episodes. I've been training a few of the players, uh, so that's good. But I really only want to train the young talent. Uh, so what I've gone ahead and also done is uh, gotten a lot of youth staff. Unfortunately, you didn't get the best pick of the draw with the youth scouts. But, you know, they're still pretty decent. And hopefully they'll give me a good player eventually. Uh, so that's what I'm really looking forward to. Uh, just a quick look at the calendar, you guys. As you can see, we've got four of our regular season games coming up. And as you can see here, this was a 4-1 loss to uh, PSG in the trophy champ. Um, and, you know, I'm not really mad about it. I'm really not. They deserve to win. They they absolutely, like, rape me. Like, yeah, my asshole's gaping from the rapage that happened. And I, I'm really glad I didn't record it because I would have cried. Uh, but anyway, so we're going to play our first match ever on FIFA 16 career mode, and uh, let's just get into it. Hopefully we can get that W, and hopefully I can make you guys proud, and maybe get some uh, some good uh, players in form from this game. But we're going to go ahead and jump into this game. Uh, so what I'm going to be showing you guys is the highlights of the game. Not really going to uh, really do a lot of, like, you know... Uh, commentary or anything like that. I'm just I'm just gonna go in the game. It's gonna have my reactions, and that's pretty much it. So, all right, let's get into it. Oh, oh, here it is. Finesse. Oh, Fakir. Please just put it in the back of the net. I beg. I beg of you. Nice return pass. Come on, come on, get some Azuma. That's what I thought. The bitch. Okay. Yeah, he's hurt. He's hurt because he went up against Zuma. So, oh, find him in. Oh. From the off because of that. Well done, Fakir. Oi, oi. Find him in the middle. Okay. Find him backside. Good run, Fakir. Keep it in. Well done. Get across. Oh my God. This. Oh, that would have been such a good play. Oh, Fakir, I'm telling you, you guys, Fakir is the best player on my team. Alright, alright, we're going to play more, uh, more controlled here. Really just try to pass it around the box and move the ball. That way, that way we can hopefully find the gap and find the ball in. Okay, here we go. 
Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Find Lacazette. Big shot. Have a hit. Ooh, that is great defending by their side. Oh, my God. Whoa. Handball. Oh. You know, that's the best attack we've had so far. Uh, but this is this is it for the half. Can we get something before half? Wait. Wait. Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. So, uh, let's go ahead and get into the second half. Hopefully, we can get a good goal here. And not lose the ball off the kickoff. Thank you. You know what? This is looking like a good attack. This is looking like a good attack. Woohoo! Oh, kickoff, baby. Still have not fixed some things, I see, EA. Oh, man. What a goal from Lacazette. I believe that is the first of the season. I'm still sick, you guys. Sorry. But that lucky little touch there, and the defender just accidentally runs past, and there it is. Lacazette gets the open of the open goal of dreams on their keeper who, of course, just... You can't save that. You don't know where he's going that close to the net. And, of course, we get our first goal. Uh, so there it is. Lacazette holds the first goal of the regular season. And what a goal it was. Just, just you know, easy finish. Not not too great, but, you know, still a really good goal. So hopefully we can get another one. Hopefully maybe get Brandt or Fakir a good chance to shine our team. I mean, look at this. I'm just away now. Lacazette. Oh, my God. That worked. Like, I feel like momentum is everything in this game. Like, how did this work? I won the ball, and their goalie was... Why is he there? This is world class, you guys. Why is he there? Why is the goalie out of the net? <laughs> that is so stupid. Their defender actually almost got to it, which is pretty impressive. But why? Why is a goalie doing that? That's There's no reason why you should be doing that. Stay in your net. Move the ball like 10 feet. Come on, please. Oh, oh God. Oh God. Oh, what a save from Lopez. That is why you're still in my team, son. And I am so stopped up right now, you guys. I am so sorry. <laughs> yeah, we're just going to go ahead and get Taliso off. Uh, Taliso, I love how I waited until I got the ball to do this, but Taliso seems to be injured. So what we're going to do is we're going to sub on Ferry uh, or, oh, actually Darter. Darter for Ferry, my bad. Or Darter for Taliso. <laughs> Uh, and then what we're going to actually do is uh, we're going to experiment with this a little bit. Raphael is going to come come into the middle. We're going to sub Raphael off for Rose, who has been a good prospect for a young player. And Zuma is going to go out wide to right back as his secondary position. So Raphael is going to take a break. Hasn't really been doing that great for me. Not really noticeable. And he's going to sit on the sideline. As well as Cornette is going to come in up top for Lacazette. Because I really want to get him in, in good form. Uh, and yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Ghazi, I, I really don't like Ghazi, to be honest. but Or Gazel, whatever his name is. But, you know, he may just be a loan opportunity. I may just loan him out and hope to see if he gets better. But uh, anyway, that's what I'm going to do for this match. For the remainder of the match. And uh, hopefully it makes a good impression on the match. Because I really, really, really think that this is a good good opportunity to get some good playing time because we're already up 2-0. Cornet is actually a really good uh, backup striker. I'm not even kidding. Greedy Air with a perfect fucking run. Oh, no! It makes me take a touch there. Oh, but that was good pressure by Greedy Air. And man, oh man, my team is just, you know, they're doing so well. God, boys. Find it wide. It's just, it's so easy. Where's their team? I know they're ultra-attacking right now, but... Oh, my God. Fuck here. Uh, he can't... I... Uh, it's like he's hitting it with his purse every time. Anyway, you guys, that is the game. Oh, my Lord. 2-0 in our first match. Lacazette with two easy goals. Pretty much back-to-back. -back. I don't know what happened. Uh, but, you know... The goalkeeper just said, fuck the game, and he just left the fucking goal, and I've never seen that happen in real life, but, you know, it happened today, so, anyway, uh, just, 
honestly, just be grateful. We're, we're grateful to that goalkeeper for being such an idiot. Uh, so, it, as you can see, Taliso did not actually get injured in that match. He was just, you know, maybe he just sprained something or maybe he just tweaked it. But he doesn't seem to have been injured, so that's a good thing. And as you can see, you guys, with with me winning my preseason tournament, I have had enough salary or enough uh, yearly budget to go ahead and get another career mode god. Now, this is Yori Tiemens. Now, Tiemens is going to be a perfect center defensive mid or center mid uh, for my team, and he's going to absolutely destroy this season. So, uh, but with this signing, I will have no money, you guys. No money whatsoever. So, I'm going to go ahead and sign him as an important first team player because, as you can see, he's already got Gonalons and, you know, a bunch of other people in front of him, like Taliso. So hopefully he can just, you know, be okay with an important first team player and just switch him out every other game. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. So as you can see, it's an update. Don't really care about that. Uh, but now we're going up against a good squad. We're going up against EA Gwidcamp. And Gwidcamp is pretty good, you guys. They're pretty good. Uh, I've, played, I've played with them. I've played against them. And they're a pretty decent squad in the League One. So hopefully we can get a win. And uh, hopefully we can really show what our squad could do. Oh, well done, Raphael. You called for it at the line, Fakir. Go to it. Yes. Yes. Oh, what? Raphael? What? That went in. Raphael just scored that. What the absolute fuck? No, so, oh my god, that's a great goal from none other than the Man U, or X Man U player, Raphael, who has made a good run up the line to give the ball to Fakir, and has continued his run, and look at that shot, oh my god, off the post and in, holy shit, I did not think he was going to score that, I thought it was going to deflect and maybe get a deflection goal, if anything, but holy shit, lost the ball there. Shit, can't lose the ball there. Shit, Zuma, Zuma, trust our keeper. Yes, Lopez! Holy shit, I thought for sure that was a goal. Lopez with a fucking grade A save. Look at that, off of his fucking bingo arms. Yes. Yes. What a save. Oh my god, that's got to be the best save that he's had so far. Okay, you guys, we're going to do a little bit of subs here. Um, uh, some of my boys are a little tired, as you can see, uh, Lacazette, uh, I'm gonna replace with, uh, Cornette, uh, just to sort of give him a breather, because I really just don't want him working his ass off a little bit too much, like, because if he does end up getting, uh, getting tired, you know, he, he has a higher chance in this game of pulling a muscle, and you really don't want that, so, uh, yeah, so Fakir... What we may do is, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put Fakir in the middle and push Cornet on the right wing to help maybe booster or, or bolster the attack a little bit because Cornet is a little bit faster than Fakir, uh, just a tad. Or no, 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 Fakir's a little bit faster, but you know, I'd rather I want to see what Fakir can do at striker. That is his main position. So uh, the next move, I know I said I wasn't going to do it last last game, but I think the next move is Gazi. To put Gazi at center attacking mid for Greenier. And then, of course, let's try giving Rose another chance. Uh, this time, let's take off Fofana. Because Fofana doesn't even play center back anymore. Let's go ahead and take him out. And put Rose in next to Zuma. So. And Barcelona bought Coutinho for $35 million. Oh my god, the wind-up, and you hit it right at the keeper! Oh, I thought that was going to be a good goal there. Oh, what a save from their keeper, who's had a very uh, rocky game. Oh my god, the defense! World-class defense is ridiculous. They pull it out of their ass all the time. Please, win this. Well done, I No, no, not now! Anytime but now. Thank you, God, Rose. Oh, that's a super sub right there. Yeah, they've got to keep the shape. 
it's not time to throw the centre half and the goalkeeper forward yet. But here we go. Here. Oh, yes, he's just made the keeper. <laughs> yes, finally, Fakir has gotten his first goal, you guys. Oh, Meg the fucking keeper. What a fucking goal. Oh, and I'm really glad they didn't fix that in this game as well. That would have missed. Any other time that would have missed. Hit him right in the nuts. Bounces down. Well, there you have it, you guys. We have won our second game. Oh, my God. So, we have won both games today. Tiamans has act he's accidentally rejected our offer, you guys. Um... He says uh, he likes Montpellier. One. Uh, so he says that he's a top player at his current club and don't feel like the move suits me. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and make him an important four years. And we're going to bump it up to, say, I'd say 60. 60 is a good bump up. That's 15K more a week than what I was going to offer him. So that's... That's a good deal for TMNs. If he doesn't take that, that's a little stupid. Uh, but basically what we're going to do now, you guys, is I'm going to sim a few days. Uh, see what happens. And of course, as you can see, our player is sold there. And there you go. TMNs has accepted the transfer offer. Uh, so I really think that's a good signing, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and sign him. TMNs is going to be an outstanding player for us. Uh, so that is a very, very good signing for us. So update from France don't care. So as you can see, Mavimba's deal has gone through. He is gone. And so is Malbrain Q. Malbrainer. I have never been able to say his name. Uh, and Tiemens is now a part of our team. So uh, starting next episode, you know, Tiemens will start to make his appearance uh, into the squad. And that'll really be a cool little... But yeah, that's basically it uh, for this episode. In the next episode, we will be playing in two more matches as well as the transfer deadline uh, day will probably show up then, I believe, right? Is that correct? Uh, yeah, the next episode, the transfer deadline day will show up. And I don't think we're going to really get anyone else. So I think we're pretty much good at this point. Uh, but anyway, if you like this video, go ahead and leave a like. If you did not like this video, tell me what you didn't like about it. And uh, if you really like my videos, you guys, go ahead and hit that sub button. It really helps me out. You'll never miss a, uh, an episode of this. Uh, and uh, yeah. Basically, that's it. I just want to say, you know, thank you guys so much for watching, and I love you guys, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.